The French Caesar truck mounted gun howitzer, developed by GIAT. The acronym Caesar stands for Camion Equipe d'un Système d'Artillerie, or truck equipped with an artillery system. It is a successor to self moving artillery guns, fitted with auxiliary power unit. It evolved from the F3 self propelled howitzer, based on the AMX 13 light tank chassis. This artillery system was designed to meet the fire support requirements of rapid deployment forces. The Caesar was revealed in 1994. At the time of its introduction, the concept of truck mounted artillery systems was very unusual. Initial five systems were delivered to the French Army for evaluation in 2003. First production vehicles were delivered in 2007. French Army ordered a total of 72 systems to replace the towed TRF 1 155mm howitzers. Export operators are Morocco, Thailand, and Saudi Arabia, 80. French Army howitzers saw action in Afghanistan and Mali. In 2022, a total of 18 of the French Caesar systems were delivered to Ukraine in order to defend against the Russian invasion. That was 25% of the French Army inventory. During the same year, France ordered additional 18 Caesar systems to replenish the French Army inventory. In 2023, it was announced that France will deliver another 12 Caesar systems to Ukraine. The Caesar was the first mass produced truck mounted howitzer. This unusual concept of mounting a powerful howitzer on a military truck chassis eventually proved to be successful. Other countries followed the trend introduced their own truck mounted artillery systems. The Caesar is completed with 155mm L52 gun howitzer, fitted with semi automatic ammunition loading system. It fires all standard NATO 155mm ammunition, including ordinary and rocket assisted HEFRAG shells cargo shells with anti-tank or fragmentation bomblets, smoke and illumination shells. Maximum range of fire is 42 km with rocket-assisted HEFRAG shells. Caesar is also capable of direct firing at ranges of up to 2 km. This artillery system is compatible with bonus precision-guided anti-tank munitions. Each bonus shell carries two smart anti-tank submunitions to a range of 34 km, maximum rate of fire is 6 shells per minute. Vehicle carries 18 shells and associated charges. The Caesar has an armored cab which protects the crew members during traveling. It accommodates 6 crew members and provides protection against small arms fire and artillery shell splinters. A 12.7mm machine gun can be mounted on top of the roof for self-protection. This artillery system is fitted with the fast-hit computerized fire control system, muzzle velocity radar and navigation system with GPS. It provides onboard terminals for communication and firing sequence management. Coordinates for the firing mission can be prepared and set into the fire control system while the howitzer is on the move. So there is no need to waste time for that in the firing position. The Caesar can be set into and out of action in less than one minute. Brief redeployment time allows to avoid counter-battery fire. It is well suited for shoot and scoot missions. Prototypes of this artillery system was based on a Mercedes-Benz Unimog 6x6 truck chassis. Production systems for the French Army are mounted on the Renault Sherpa 5 6x6 truck chassis. It is powered by Renault DCI 6 turbocharged diesel engine, developing 240 horsepower. Vehicle is fitted with a central tire pressure system, which is adjusted from the driver's seat. Interestingly howitzers supplied to Saudi Arabia are also based on the Mercedes-Benz Unimog U2450 L6 by 6 chassis. These are operated by the Saudi National Guard. The Caesar is fully air transportable and can be airlifted by the C-130 Hercules or a 400M transport aircraft. A typical battery consists of eight Caesar howitzers. It can disperse more than one ton of shells in one minute. A salvo of six over cargo shells releases 378 bomblets and saturates area of three hectares. Each Caesar howitzer is escorted by the ammunition resupply vehicle. The Caesar howitzers were widely used in Ukraine during the 2022 Russian invasion. This French howitzer recommended itself extremely well. It was far superior to Russian artillery systems in terms of range, accuracy, and shoot and scoot capabilities. Ukrainians often used these systems for counter-battery fire, 
as these outranged the majority of Russian artillery systems. Version of the Caesar, based on the Ashok Leland Super Stallion 6x6 military truck. It was aimed at Indian market and was presented in 2014. Caesar MK.2 is a new version. Its development was funded by the French Defense Procurement Agency. This artillery system uses a new chassis of an Arquis Armis 6x6 truck. It is more mobile due to its 460 horsepower engine and comes with a better protected armored cab. Cab armor corresponds with Stanag 4569 protection level 2. It provides ballistic protection against 7.62 by 39 mm armor piercing rounds and artillery shell splinters. The cab withstands mine blasts equivalent to 6 kilograms of TNT. Despite improvements the Caesar MK.2 is still airportable by the Airbus A400M or similar military transport aircraft. Belgium ordered nine of these artillery systems. In 2022 Lithuania ordered 18 of these artillery systems. Caesar 8x8 or Caesar 2 emerged more than 20 years after the original Caesar. It was first publicly revealed in 2015. It is based on a Tatra T815-78 x 8 chassis. Gun of the new artillery system remains without significant changes, however weapon control system has been updated. So the Caesar 8x8 can shoot faster and is more accurate than its predecessor. Furthermore the chassis allows to carry almost twice more ammunition. This artillery system was ordered by Denmark and Czech Republic. In 2023 Denmark announced that it sends all of its, several, Caesar 8x8 systems to Ukraine. 